Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and we're going to talk about USB ports because there are various types of problems that can arise from the USB ports on a PC. And 99% um, of the problems of USB ports has nothing to do with Windows but either a device, the USB ports themselves or the hardware that is actually hosting these USB ports. So what goes wrong with USB ports in general is uh, first of all they can freeze because of various um, devices that are plugged in that have a problem so for example anything that could do a short uh, could actually freeze the USB ports they do have some protection so you know a short will actually shut down your PC for example to prevent damage but one of the things that can happen is, uh, for example, with uh, trackpads on laptops or even certain connected mice, you might actually have static electricity discharge with your hands when you touch the device. This will also freeze devices and sometimes freeze the USB ports. The chip becomes unresponsive. Now, one of the things that you could do is remove completely remove the power from your computer. And this usually works because when the power is off, it actually resets the USB ports. In some computers, like a laptop that with, with the battery that is integrated, more and more laptops today are like that. It's a little more difficult sometimes to reset uh, that functionality. But some of the problems could be there. Um, so simply removing the power for a couple of minutes and then restarting your PC with the power on usually often fixes the problem. Um, disconnect every possible device from your USB ports. It happens regularly that one device is creating a problem with the USB ports and other devices connected to the USB ports. So this is also something that you should check out. There is one other fix that could happen. It doesn't happen often, but I had to do that a few times over the years as a tech guy, is uh, going to the device manager. And in the device manager, what you will do is go down to the uh, USB serial bus controllers. Here you will see something called USB root hub. What you could do is right click on that uninstall the device and uninstall all the root hubs that you have in Windows in the device manager and then uh, what you could do is go into action and click scan for hardware changes what this will do is it will reinstall completely the USB hubs and devices that are connected to make sure that everything is alright so these are little tips and tricks that you can try to help with USB problems on your computer and like I said 99% of the time it is hardware related much more than Windows like a lot of problems actually if you enjoy our videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching